So hi everybody, it's uh, Michael Davis here, MCD Reptiles. Anyways, uh, I'm just making this video as a remembrance video of my giant day gecko Juno who sadly passed away at noon today. Um, apparently I took her to the vet, the vet told me uh, that she didn't have a respiratory infection, it seemed more like she had gotten bit by a poisonous uh, spider or something like that got into her tank and most likely what killed her was her being envenomated by possibly a baby black widow that got into her cage somehow, I don't know how but somehow I guess it got in there and I guess it bit her while she was eating it and um, the and the, uh, the venom just took effect more than I thought it would I thought maybe well, she might pull out of it today but I took her over there and the sad part of it was the fact that it uh was the fact that, yeah, she had, uh, uh, poison was just too much for her. And so, the venom that the spider injected into her, I guess, was just too much for her. And I'm saddened by the fact. But I also live in a belief that, you know, um, I shouldn't feel sad about it too much. Uh, I see a lot of people who do sulk over their loss of their animals. However, the way I live is, you could say I live the life of a jet, like the way a Jedi would. If you guys believe in Star Wars, I know it's kind of funny, but anyways, I do live the life a way like a Jedi, with the belief that how a Jedi is, that um, I shouldn't be sad that she passed away and let it take over my life. Um, while she was here, I had a great time with her while she was here. And so, in the quotes of my favorite Star Wars character Yoda, who's a Jedi Master. If you guys remember who he is, you probably do. But uh, anyways, in the quotes of him, uh, for those of you who have lost an animal, I would have to say, don't, do not, do not cry for the ones that pass on, but be uh, grateful that you for the time that you had with them. Um, miss them, do not, and just it's okay to miss them and all that. Just don't let it soak. Just don't soak over it. Don't feel sad about it all the time. Just realize that this is a circle of life and uh, move on. But on, a little, but on a more positive note now, then I got that off my chest, I got a little bit more of a positive note. I did get something new to replace her. Um, I know you guys, some of you guys may think it's kind of early for me to be thinking about getting a replacement for her. But I decided to because it would just make me feel bad just looking at an empty tank for a while. So uh, anyways, I'm going to show you guys exactly what I got her. Alright, so uh, just bear with me on this one. Alright, so yeah. Anyways, I don't know if you can see him in the background, but that is, uh, if it'll focus, that is my new veiled chameleon that I just got today to replace Juno. Like I said, she passed away not because of anything I did, but just because of something stupid she did. But, uh, anyways, uh, I got, I just decided to replace her or something else. Even though I was feeling a little bummed. But this guy is hopefully going to get my spirits back up. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah. So, once again, as far as the naming, con as far as the naming contest is now, it's not going to include naming this guy as well. So, come up with a good name. I was thinking of naming him after the one that uh, Mike Tylula had, uh, had lost. And, Mike, if you're going to watch this, I hope, I really hope you don't mind if I name him after the one. But I forgot what the name of the one you lost was, was called. And I would really love to, and I don't know if it would be alright if I named this little guy after you. After, uh, after the one you lost. Uh, so let me know what you think, Mike. Uh, should I, if that would be okay with you if I named him after the one you lost, uh, uh, just out of, uh, you know, let's see, what would I call that, what do you call that, yeah, just out of, uh, respect for the, for the one you lost, um. Uh, and uh, just in the memory, just f in memory of him, anyways, of the one you of, of the one you lost, and so yeah, just let me know, Mike, uh, if you think that'd be a good idea to name him, to name him after the one you that you've lost. So uh, yep, go ahead, go ahead, and uh, help me name this guy now too, as well as the I'm still waiting on names for the uh, bearded dragon. So uh, please, please, uh, please continue to put those entries in for the bearded dragon, and I'll also put some entries in for this guy as well. Let me, uh, let me know what you guys think. Alright, so once again, this is Michael Davis, NCD Reptiles, checking out. Peace.